It's raining cats and dogs yet again. This is one of those moments where I just kind of scratch my head. Chris says, oh hey Jax, why don't you set this thing up? I've never set it up before. I have no idea what I'm doing. Bingo, that wasn't too hard. I just realized a really cool thing about the rain. No mosquitoes. So we uh, spent a lot of time in Home Depot. We've got nails, screws, actually no nails, just screws and more screws. And uh, just having a nice educational experience, thanks to Chris. Thank you, Chris. Thanks for your patience. <laughs> it's been interesting today, to say the least. So we're back from Home Depot and I just realized we made a pretty bad mistake. We left the chair in the rain and it's been raining for a couple days on the chair now. I do want to replace the chair with an excursion seat, so it's not the worst worst thing that could happen or go wrong, but didn't think about this in advance. We've got some good news. After a brief intermission, it stopped raining and we're about to get to work. And uh, check out this replacement piece of metal that we got here. We took it to the uh, metal shop and we got an exact replica, but just a little bit longer. So it covers some stuff in the bus that it didn't before. Now, uh, just getting things in order. Then we're gonna start on the subfloor. But right now we are going to cut the two by fours down to size. We're gonna do three quarters and we are gonna put wood in between the insulation like this and then against the whole edge of the uh, of the bus. Alright. Feel good? Yeah. Alright. There we go, test piece number one. So we just blew a fuse. It's going turning off all the electricity. I don't know. Let's see if this works. Take two. Mm, turned off again. We are now gonna go get two pieces of plywood and we're gonna cut our own three quarter inch thick pieces to put along the edges and in between the insulation. There's no three quarter inch pine at the Home Depot, so I ended up getting this stuff. It was kind of expensive. It was oak. And we're back here, and uh, hopefully this will fix our solution. Why are we so, oh yeah, we're short, cause uh, I'm like, wait, did we mess up? There should be two inches on each side. Yeah. So, how do you this right? That should be four inches. Let's see. Did he do it right, ladies and gentlemen? Ah, uh, just under, just shy. We're call a day right now. Yeah. I'd say that was pretty good work though. High five. That deserves definitely a high five. Yeah. There's a lot of unexpected little bumps and bruises along the way. Nothing we can't handle, just figuring it out. It's, um, yeah. I didn't anticipate the two by four is not working because you can't predict uh, that the saw would short out everything and then have to replace the wood and all that stuff. So um, we'll finish it tomorrow. I just don't have the amperage in the, in the garage to be able to pull it off. Yeah, and, no, no. and also the saw does, probably doesn't have enough power to pull through that, huh? Yeah. So. Oh well. It's all good though, until tomorrow. I like this better, it's easier.